It's a place to remember. A place to reflect. A place to honor. The courage and sacrifice of the Vietnam War soldier, the fighting men affectionately known as the Grunts. That's what I was assigned to as a platoon officer, to lead a platoon of Grunts. Those were the guys that were tromping the rice paddies, crawling around the jungle and the mountains, etc., going face to face with the enemy. And his time in Vietnam, the memories, the grunts, stayed with Mike Lind and led him on a journey that ended with an idea. An idea to create a museum dedicated to the soldiers of Vietnam. These guys were in the same area as I was, but they were in a little different situation. And today they come to visit, to remember. Imagine jumping off the chopper eight feet out of the ground, a hot LZ. To meet old friends. One guy walked in the day, the first thing we saw was the guy he went to school with as a vet too. <laughs> and to honor friends now gone. Many of the exhibits donated by Vietnam vets themselves. Yeah, some of my pictures are there. Pieces of their memories and their lives, displayed for old soldiers to remember and for young minds to learn and understand. You can feel it, you can touch it, you can see it. And uh, uh, my real goal is I wanted to have it available for the youth. The important thing was I was trying to reach a younger group and through pictures obviously is the easiest way to do that. I had several uh, groups come through here and uh, they were very, very good kids. They were interested. And that's what this museum is all about. Touching people, helping them remember the past and honor the grunts, the American soldiers of the Vietnam War. If you'd like to visit the museum in San Antonio, Texas, it's open three days a week, Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays from nine to five. And you can visit the museum website at vietnamgrunts.org. Come and experience the lives of the everyday soldiers. Well, the first thing you do is give them a hug and welcome them home.